First you will need 10 to 20 gallon tank for babies, a juvenile. If your breaded dragon is an adult you will need a 40 to 60 gallon tank. Second, substrate it's suggested to use carpets or paper towels. And not substrate like sand because if they accidentally eat the sand it will get stuck in their digestive system and die. Third food you will need these foods for your breaded dragon. Bugs like crickets, dubby roaches, mealworms, locusts, silkworms, earthworms. Fourth, veggies, food bok choy, collard greens, mustard greens, arugula, dandelion greens, radicchio, escaroli, turnip greens, and a parsley, occasionally swishered cashina. Sixth, treats provide lots of fat, so don't feed them these every day, especially if they're babies. Treats are superworms, hornworms, waxworms, butterworms, and more. Make sure you don't feed them things like avocados and stuff like that because it's toxic. BTW, I suggest not feeding too much carrots to breaded dragons because they can throw up. 7. Tall structures, you should have a place set taller than others. That's sort of under the light. Like a piece of driftwood, a hammock, or some akin to climbable object. I also suggest dubby roaches more than crickets and locusts. If temperature your UVB light or whatever light you have has to be the temperature of 110 to 120. Sometimes 100 temperature is okay for different types of breaded dragons whether your breaded dragon likes the warm or the cooler temperatures. 9. Hide you will need a hide for your breaded dragon just in case if they're scared. They'll have something to retreat to to stay safe. Also your breaded dragon's bread will turn black sometimes and that's just a sign that your breaded dragon is frustrated and upset. Also, they like to sleep on their hide to bask, or they will sleep in their hide. Or sleep on their tall structure. Everything you need for your breaded dragon list. Tank. Heat lamp. UVB light. Water dish. Food dish. Climbable objects. Heights. Food. Calcium. Vitamins.